Coverage you can count on continues with Sarah Schaefer and meteorologist Rob Leidick. Summer is almost here, and that means it's time to get outside in the fort. <laughs> One of the activities that you can do is trek the trails. It runs all summer long, and this morning we're joined by Kent Castleman, the executive director of Fort Wayne Trails, correct? Yes. Okay, thank you so much for joining us. Tell us, what is Trek the Trails? Absolutely. Trek the Trails was created. It's a partnership between Fort Wayne Trails and the city of Fort Wayne, and it's an opportunity for people to just come out and explore the trails. So a lot of people don't know where trails lead or they might want to try a new trail and so throughout the summer every Tuesday we offer an opportunity for people to take a ride and some Saturdays um, to, to jump on the trails as well and just learn a new path. And the Fort Wayne trail system has been expanding over the past couple of years. Are there some new trails in particular that people should definitely check out this year? Um, yeah, absolutely. We're, we are always working on things. Um, we're we're to getting to the 100 milestone, 100 mile milestone. Wow. Um, it's wow. a wonderful thing. We have 91 miles built in Allen County already, and we're working to get to that 100. But um, big projects this year. One of the projects a lot of people are excited to see, it's been almost a decade in the making, is the finishing of the Covington Road Trail um, out by West Hamilton. And so that's a, a great opportunity once that gets started. So. It's so cool. And I bet there's a lot of trails that people might not realize are there. You could say, oh, I didn't know that trail was there. Or talk Absolutely. about how many there really are. Well, there's, there's lots of ways. And, and the biggest thing is people a lot of times don't know where they're at in the city. And so yeah. it's like, or in the county, they pop out and they're like, oh, this is where I'm at. And they drive maybe on the road and they know where they're at. But the trail gives you a whole nother view, a whole nother connection to nature, a whole nother connection to, to just being a part of what that is. Very and speaking cool. of connections, uh, one way for people to feel really connected, I think, to these trails mm -hmm. is to get involved. How can they do that? Absolutely. Um, our website is fwtrails.org, and uh, that's a great way to find out about the Truck the Trail schedule. Um, we're also excited right now, we're a part of the um, Art Van Charity Challenge, and so this is a challenge that goes on for the next six weeks. Um, and there are 350 charities across the nation chosen, and Fort Wayne Trails is one of those. And wow. so if we raise the most, we could have an additional 100,000 towards okay. trail building here. And wow. so we encourage people to, to come and donate on, at fortwaynetrails.org. Um, and go to that link for the Art Van Charity Challenge, okay. yeah. And talk about, obviously, it's important to us and you, but why is this so cool? I mean, to get out there and not only learn about your trails, but you can help for development, too. Absolutely. I think that there's a lot of uh, a lot of link for people to want to be healthy these days, and I think it's an easy, natural way for people to go out, and there's not a lot of stress. I mean, there's not a lot of people who are going to run the 100 mile, um, 100 miles or bike 100 miles mm -hmm. like, like the bicycle uh, the, the Fort for Fitness this morning, and it's just a, an awesome opportunity to be a leisurely but be healthy, mm -hmm. and I think that's part of it. And in development, um, from an economic development standpoint, every uh, parcel that attaches to trails is improved in property value, and so Absolutely. it's a great economic development tool, and, and we're excited to be a part of the, uh, potentially a part of the Regional Cities Initiative as well, and so we're right. looking forward to where that will lead, um, and that'll hopefully go to a, a regional connector. We're trying mm -hmm. to connect Wabash State Park in Bluffton all the way to Pokagon State Park in Angola. Wow. It'd be an 81 mile trail and it would wow. be a regional connector. And oh so we're gosh. just extremely excited about that opportunity. It's, it's gonna take a while to get oh, there, yeah. sure. but, but we have to start with that goal and, and about 25% of that is already actually built. Wow. Um, so 22 miles of the 81, so we're excited. Cool. Very well, cool. best of luck Exciting and thank news. you for joining yeah. us. Thanks for coming Appreciate in this morning, it. Kent. The next Trek the Trails event is happening at Shove Park this Tuesday. For more information, just head over to wayne.com.